Wednesday is the 10th of May, 2019, Friday of the third week of Easter. It is the memorial of Saints Damien du Vestor. Our first reading is from the Acts of the Apostles. Saul, still breathing murderous threats against the disciples of the Lord, went to the high priest and asked him for letters to the synagogues in Damascus, that, if he should find any men or women who belonged to the way, he might bring them back to Jerusalem in chains. On his journey, he was nearing Damascus. A light from the sky suddenly flashed around him. He fell to the ground and heard a voice saying to him, So, so, why are you persecuting me? He said, Who are you? The reply came, I am Jesus, whom you are persecuting. Now get up and go into the city, and you will be told what you must do. The men who were travelling with him stood speechless, for they heard the voice but could see no one. Saul got up from the ground, but when he opened his eyes he could see nothing. So they led him by the hand and brought him to Damascus. For three days he was unable to see, and he neither ate nor drank. There was a disciple in Damascus named Ananias, and the Lord said to him in a vision, Ananias. He answered, Here I am, Lord. And the Lord said to him, Get up and go to the street called Straight, and ask at the house of Judas for a man from Tarsus named Saul. He is there praying, and in a vision he has seen a man named Ananias come in and lay his hands on him, that he may regain his sight. But Ananias replied, Lord, I have heard from many sources about this man, what evil things he has done to your holy ones in Jerusalem. And here he has authority from the chief priests to imprison all who call upon your name. But the Lord said to him, Go, for this man is a chosen instrument of mine to carry my name before Gentiles kings and children of Israel, and I will show him what he will have to suffer for my name. So Ananias went and entered the house. Laying his hands on him, he said, So, my brother, the Lord has sent me, Jesus who appeared to you on the way which you came, and then you may regain your sight and be filled with the Holy Spirit. Immediately, things like scales fell from his eyes and he regained his sight. He got up and was baptized, and when he had eaten, he recovered his strength. He stayed some days with disciples in Damascus, and he began at once to proclaim Jesus in the synagogues that he was the Son of God. The Word of the Lord. Thanks be to God.